Have you ever wondered why the purpose of publicly funded universities in Canada seems to be shifting? Are these institutions truly focused on educating their own citizens, or are they turning into profit-driven entities, churning out degrees for foreign students who have no intention of contributing to the Canadian economy? Publicly funded universities in Canada were initially established to provide affordable and accessible education for Canadians. They were meant to be the training grounds for the nation's workforce, preparing young minds to contribute to the economic and social development of the country. However, a closer look at the current state of affairs paints a different picture. The number of foreign students in Canadian universities has been steadily increasing over the years. According to data from the Canadian Bureau for International Education, the number of international students in Canada increased by a staggering 89% from 2014 to 2019. This influx of foreign students is not necessarily a bad thing. After all, universities are places for cultural exchange and knowledge sharing. But a problem arises when these students, particularly those studying in critical fields such as medicine, return to their home countries after graduation. Take for example the situation with medical schools. A significant number of seats are occupied by students from Saudi Arabia who complete their education, do their internships, and then return to their home country. This leaves a gaping hole in the Canadian healthcare system. A report from the Royal College of Physicians and Surgeons of Canada revealed that the country will face a shortage of nearly 2,000 family doctors by 2030. This is a direct consequence of the country's inability to retain foreign-trained doctors and the limited opportunities for Canadian students to pursue medical education. The question that arises then is, are Canadian universities, despite being publicly funded, primarily serving foreign students at the expense of Canadian citizens? If this trend continues, it will not only impact the quality of education available to Canadian students but also have far-reaching implications for the country's economy and public services. The very purpose of publicly funded universities in Canada is at stake. It's high time that Canadians demand a change, a change in the system that prioritizes the education of its citizens, a change that ensures that publicly funded universities serve their original purpose, to educate Canadians who will contribute to the country's economy. The time for action is now. Stand up and make your voice heard. Demand a change in the system. Your country's future depends on it.